Like if you look at the people that are mostly, well, I guess everyone is affected by the hikes and the fuel prices, but but the, the people that are feeling most of the pinch, yeah. the working class, right? Yeah. Class, tax increase that, that gets mm. uh, the ones that get fuel uh, increase mm. you ones know that get taxed and what the landlord reaches out to you and tells you no withholding tax now or rental income tax has to be paid by the landlord by the landlord so you, know? you need to i need to buy yeah. the for somebody who lives like um i don't think the landlord would even bother actually <laughs> 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 they are all right. That's, yeah. they just be giving me i'll come and get they even have some guy who come who goes around and when you see him you know you have to Mm-hmm. Use the cash. No stories. In my case, it was formal, right? No, we have to revise the lease agreement. Well, because of the same, yeah. man. Nah. <laughs> yeah, we have to sign a new lease agreement. Like, okay. Yeah. yeah. Also, you had it up uh, notch. Yeah. Yeah, so, so it's like that. So, for the most part, they just look at the yeah, okay, with the least hassle. From a number of our uh, these taxpayers, we just need to make sure we maximize from this same mm. same ones, and then these guys we uh, we won't forget to get in eh? here. Oh, you want us to go? I don't know. Is there? In, yeah, I think there's a place yeah, from up, up up there. there. Yeah. It's crowded. I yeah, I get it. Like to avoid some of these because they'll be. Yeah. You're getting very few things, but and then you queue up. Yeah. You queue up. And yeah, plus it's a long weekend, so I'm sure the place yeah. is crowded. Yeah. That's true. So I was asking him, is there a road, right, that mm. takes you on the other side of the city? Mm. Um, but it turns out you can only use, for now, you can only use Leopard Hill to get in and get out. Oh, oh you were but I think, out Yeah, if, you if there's a like direct connection. Security, you know, people are obsessed with insecurity, which they don't really even do anything. Because, you know, if you look at the thefts that take place in the Minwood, you start wondering what the whole point of having some yeah. of those. Uh, I mean, most of the time when I drive through, like the last time I drove through, I, was, uh, I told you I was using Mission Drive. Mm. I was literally passing through those mass security checkpoints and they're not asking. You know, they'll have these uh, signage that will say uh, only people that live there yeah, are allowed, mm-hmm. right? Mm. But they don't even bother to check. You're just driving through. Anyway, I guess maybe it sort of helps and reduces. Maybe it would have been much worse if, uh, <coughs> if we didn't have something like that. 
ostatnie. Violent sort of crime or yeah. oh, meanwhile. Mm. Ah, but recently, food somebody just posted, shared some picture about these guys who like um, uh, they literally broke a garage door. Hmm. Broke a garage door and went away with some vehicle. Vehicle. Prized possession. <laughs> yeah. uh, you guys who are busy trying to come in here by. <laughs> Why won't you guys be as far away from them as possible? <laughs> but all that is changing now. I mean, it's um, <laughs> that, that kind of thinking uh, made sense 50 years ago. So mm -hmm. Not anymore. Mm -hmm. no, yeah, but yeah, a lot of these guys and, and a lot of these things that the way they do a lot of their things, you know, yeah. you look at places like this one, like schools like this one, the pricing models, yeah. and so you wonder, I mean. It's, it's a deliberate price. ploy yeah, to yeah, sort of like this, this screw. Mm. This guy just bashed into. I don't know if you saw that. It's a female actually. Just oh, yeah. running through that triangle. Oi, if I go to my branches, branches, yeah, come here, boy. Yeah, go to my branches, branches. Time. It's too uh, close to the thing. Yeah. So when uh, I went to see Mshashu's new Kasama mm. plot, right? We passed through here because we need to get coffee. And insane, right? I mean, Zambian coffee company. Yeah. So, Zambian. Yeah. Zambian. So the thing, right, is he got uh, what? That's probably the 250 mil. Mm. For 40 parts. No, 160 quarts. But the thing is. 40 mils. 250 mils. That was 160, 180 quarts or something. Oh, a packet, right? No, it's brewed, right? Just like 250 mils, not kilograms. Not not like you want to go and uh, not coffee beans or ground beans or something. No, uh, but like already no. brewed coffee. I for think. for how much? But anyway, one of these fancy things. But the key point here is mm. uh, one of these fancy. I've forgotten what he got. You know? oh. But the thing here is, I was trying to write on the point you raised about. Uh, a place specifically meant for a certain profile of individuals, yeah, right? Yeah. And you can see the demographics. You go yeah. in there and then you see the people that are there. Yeah. I usually pass through there every once. I, I usually do a bit of work. Mm. I come down to, but I, I mean, of course, I, I try as much as possible to get the cheapest stuff I can get. You know? yeah. So maybe just a very plain coffee, yeah. just a plain black small coffee, I think it should be somewhere like 50 kwacha or something. Uh, grab a car, I mean, yeah. But I, I usually know the times when there's uh, less, less traffic. Uh, uh, yeah, less traffic. Yeah. So I, I only ever visit it during um, like, like weekdays, right? So yeah. during the week um, when, I, when I'm not working from the office. I want to concentrate. I like it because it's far from home. You know, when you're there, you can sit. Yeah. You can sit from morning to evening without thinking about going. Yeah. Yeah, but don't ever try to buy like uh, either uh, like a packet of maybe even coffee, like roasted beans. Why, why not? 
Yeah, it's, it's expensive. It's expensive, right? <laughs> yeah. yeah. As well. yeah. I think I, I remember seeing prices. I, I was like, it's ridiculous, actually. Yeah, it's, it's quite um, ridiculous. I mean, really. Because, I mean, I, I know it's probably it's the same coffee that comes from Kasam or something. Yeah. But it's just packaged, packaged different. Yeah, packaged. You know? yeah, so better. my thinking is always, listen, I can get the same stuff from pick and pay or something. The thing is that, you know, maybe there's a bit of a difference. Right? So it's not just the packaging. Even yeah, the roasting. The same, yeah, yeah, the roasting. I know. The selection I mean, of the roast is yeah. really, yeah. It's, that's that's it's, true. Mm. That's true. But yeah. still, I mean, I've always felt the prices, are at least the price I saw was exaggerated. I can't remember how much, but yeah. I sat there and I'm like, ah, no. <laughs> <laughs> I can manage, but it's just not worth it, right? <laughs> uh, you want to manage right now. Kasama, initially I used to, I, I, I didn't know that also Kusogoli is New Kasama, right? Mm. Um, it's quite massive, is it? It's, yeah, it's, I mean, it's a huge chunk. Mm. I know there's some people sure we'll see that we can do. Uh, this place is dead. It's dead, yeah. it's closed now. Huh? But I know there should be, there should be a place just after a, a checkpoint, I think. Oh. Yeah. I don't think people have started operating from here. No, there was some, some place. Was place okay. at some point. That's not true. I've been to places where they give out. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, the, you know, these guys have taken advantage. Huh? They are those my light plastics. Uh -huh. So the the yeah. the idea behind this in the Nyakuta tea. So discourage people from uh, yeah. using. So so you start. You should. They should have started using. Um, I am. Um, these thicker recyclable mm -hmm. materials. So, but because. Okay. Well, it's probably do not see that. Yeah. Because it's uh, thicker. Yeah. Uh, it's a bit. A bit uh, they, they were given a way of trying to recover the cost. Yeah. But now people just took advantage of it and just, they just started giving for those. Uh, Thin one that was supposed to be just giving out. Mm -hmm. They said they stay charging for those. I like the, the approach. The, I was at Food Lovers, my, my Levy Junction, mm -hmm. and uh, 
because I, I, it was, I was stop, stop finding groceries, right? So I decided to take advantage of my trip there to just get get my groceries from there. And then, mm. uh, so I'm asking them, plastic, how much? Uh, the gentleman noticed that I, I mean, I was taken aback because they, they, the thing they, they sell, right? Those mm. are my, my reusable fancy looking bags are slightly expensive I think mm. that's too expensive you don't give uh, bags for free say no we only have those ba boxes so they have my boxes where you can pack your groceries the oh. ones I use yeah oh okay yeah. this thing doesn't look stable mm. needs realignment I hope he knows because this time we actually came off along Greatest Road, right? Oh. And this gentleman did not know that the wheel came off. Was it? Yeah, I was, uh, I think, two vehicles behind him. Yeah, but some people are going to come. Yeah, come on. 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 Yeah, well, people were honking at him and then eventually stopped. Actually, see the boats and the nuts coming out. Right? Mm. <laughs> That's why it's important to go for routine service here, right? Not cutting corners and say drama to leave and then you just sit there. Mm. No, sometimes come and catch the same place That's where you went. Yeah, they just forgotten to, um, to tighten it. Happened tighten, to me. Right. Mm. Mm. One minute more, Green Palm Road. So now, they open and the church. I just first, I saw somebody. Like uh, doing something as if he was trying. So my thing was that ah, he's just trying to get a lift. Yeah. So I passed. So shortly afterwards, I made it. Ah, quickly I slowed down, parked on the side, found the wheel was almost coming off. Hey, nuts gone. Oh, oh yeah. I think once I I'm going to beat it. So, the main by the why I just saw the guy coming, the same guy was uh, trying to do it. Yeah. Oh, it? With it, my nuts that came off. Oh, yeah, actually, he saw the nose. Oh, yeah. wow. <laughs> okay. Mm. Well, yeah, it was a dwarf one. Oh, yeah, man. Oh. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm friends with her because of the air oh, from air So I see those. In fact, I most recent one I saw is today. They are mm. jogging from State Lodge. State Lodge is nice because le less traffic and also the oh, terrain. Oh. Yeah. So it's this side. Oh, not here. No. But when going there, I'm sure we'll pass through State Lodge. Anyway. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. 
as we age and our lifestyle, right? Yeah. These are things to seriously take into account. Mm. You're lucky, I mean, you're married, then maybe you can convince Kasap for you to run early in the morning, just around, start with just around the neighborhood, right? I mean, I've driven yeah, through that place and. Laziness, uh, just laziness <laughs> Yeah. I do every once in a while, you know, but it's just, I think the biggest issue I have is just consistency. Oh, risk walking, not necessarily run, running, but just walking, right? Yeah, I do that also. Explicitly, because, mm. I mean, how often do you walk? You yeah, can't... yeah. That's, a, that's why I convinced myself. At the time I used to laugh at, I used to see a lot of these guys, uh, Asian community, they, yeah. uh, I don't know, uh, 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 arcades area, mm -hmm. and, uh, looks like it's a very common thing over there, right? and I like doing that, especially with uh, Indians, uh, right. so it's just, just walking about, <laughs> but now because you see it, When you get to a stage like yeah, we are at right now, yeah, yeah, you begin yeah, to, to realize so, that yeah, guys, yeah, it makes oh, sense. Even just thing, walking is the same. Because you think through, you know, you just realize that the whole week you haven't walked. Yeah? <laughs> uh, okay, good enough to consider the distance. So, Mshashu's place is, uh, because all of this is a thing, part of cross parties. So, Mshashu's place is right behind. Uh, uh, behind this thing? Yeah, behind cross -party. Oh, yeah. You've been here before? No. This is behind the first one. There are some nice activities that take place here. Well, occasionally, it's a place where maybe you just come to relax with the family or something. Yeah. Um, I think occasionally there will, there will be like an event that will be hosted here, so... Yeah. But other than that, it's just... Uh, it's very little that goes on actually, just it's come here and relax, isn't it? It's This might be one of these places that our... Uh, that Rusaka brothers bring their side arrangements. <laughs> Secluded, <laughs> right? They, yeah, yeah, these activities are very... <laughs> oh, you know, there's very little that goes on in Rusaka, but... Uh, that, that would warrant... in the number of lodges and whatever. Yeah. And that's what you, you, you'd think an increase in the number of lodges would be associated with uh, a lot of some tourist attractions or <laughs> living stones so you expect us. Mm -hmm. Lots of those. But Osaka, there's really nothing going on but the number of lodges doesn't go down. Even <laughs> But also, I guess it's the the fact that it's a, a lot of business, or business uh, activity, like workshops, will take place here. So. Yeah. So sometime last year, around this time, actually, I decided I wanted to see where or how bad or what was going on along the jam. I think it's called um, yeah, Chongwe Road or something. Oh. So you know how this this same road at branches end, off takes it to Chongwe and then the other yeah. one takes it to Chongwe. Yeah. <laughs> Big mistake. I, I spent uh, I think almost two hours driving through that stretch. So no, no, it's not. Yeah, it's not a very. It's, it's not. It's not. So it's, it's Chongwe CBD is not very far off from the junction itself, but the road is bad. That's why. Oh. It's really bad. I think at some stage. They had decided to work on the road, but I think they abandoned. They have decided to abandon works, and so um, it's like a, how many kilometers stretch? Probably, I'd say maybe 30, 40 kilometers or something. Oh, yeah. But of 
because I mean I I was making pit stops, right? Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, in fact, well, yesterday for Andes and up here, the people that side were telling me it was pouring. Oh. Yeah, the previous yeah, night. These are some of the considerations when you are trying to get a place for like a farm, right? Yeah. Rainfall patterns. But it seems here, I think here, this part of Osaka is like the uh, rain uh, thing, huh? Mm. I haven't really bothered to look up to uh, No, it should because what I noticed was that uh, even like the woodlands area coming mm -hmm. down just like yeah. it, it receives uh, uh, relatively much more rain than okay. uh, yeah, most parts of most of the country. I'm going to be excited to go to the think. Uh, Yeah, I mean, it's why you either you, you, you go with the flow, you look at where most of the farmers are, because obviously they're there for a reason, yeah, 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 or you actually plan, sit yeah. down and you, you look at these things. Yeah. The information is readily available, by the way, it's just that we don't. No, we don't take that uh, time. Yeah. Because nowadays, guy, people just say, no, go up on the land, go up on the traditional land. You know, right? I mean, you just go there. Yeah, you just go there. Yeah. Go there. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure it's still raining plenty and now. Yeah. And it's been like a long time since it rained with our massage part. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, the story was okay. She tried to go out to match and died, right? Ah, the people are going to survive the uh, uh, to survive tomorrow. Mm. <clears throat> yeah, I mean, if, granted, I mean, if they find themselves in this sort of environment, the world does evolve now. Oh, Your yeah. kids are the people that are going to survive. <laughs> the modern day world. <laughs> modern day world. Yeah. yeah. So, uh, challenges I, will be much more different. Yeah. Is, uh, mm -hmm. It won't be about who can walk the longest distance mm -hmm. now. housing development this is as well but where we're going I think it's filled up this is probably another housing development I don't know if it's written there but oh it's farm okay oh somebody's farm yeah my farm my farm houses it and up and you notice how the construction is a bit uh, unorthodox not not similar <laughs> what we're used to <laughs> Guys have started coming, also they've seen that people are bringing things here. Farm plots for sale. There may be some of the numbers to go. If I try to get some of these numbers here. Yeah. I really love this place, this area. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I really like driving through here, but I've, I've not really been convinced. Because uh, I first started coming through here when I land of Mpash, right? But this is, I don't know. Because what I've done is I've measured the distance from here up to Mpash area and it's the exact distance from uh, Lusaka CPD to that part of Trongwe, like where the smart city is. Oh. Yeah. And, and I don't know, maybe it's familiarity because I come from the eastern part of the country. Uh, my, so my mind is just wired to say that is better than here. But, oh, that place, uh, yeah, I know, it's, yeah. uh, it's quite... Um, so the same distance, right? And I'm guessing from 16 miles and, I don't know, X miles, mm. the same distance from the CBD to there as well. Yeah. I know mo most of my colleagues at work um, have decided to sort of like build there, but I just... Like 10,000 miles. I've not even bothered to actually... Yeah. I've not even bothered to go and check out what's happening there. I'm just not interested. And I don't know how the mind works sometimes, right? Yeah, I'm yeah, just biased just, towards... Uh, yeah. 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 But also my thinking is in Jokuma side there's a lot more traffic, right? That that side? That side. Mamgule area. Yeah. Yeah. Is. yeah. <clears throat> yeah. But 
what's strange is if you look at the expansion of the city, right? East Kumachongo area, Kuja Kumasai, yeah. but not so much Kumasai. And I've, I've, wondered, I've always wondered why, right? If you look at what's happening, you know, there isn't as, as much activity as you know, yeah. So, oh, so I'm telling you. Mm. Yeah. Ah, yeah, so the prices. Kasama, I think we're going to have a massage. 